Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to CSSBoss.com. I'm Andrew Kayser, and today we're going to take a look in Tacoda. And now, one of the things you notice in Coda is that when you go to your sites page, you know, it might look something like this where you have a bunch of different websites that you can connect to. Now, I've been working with Coda for about a year now, and it just dawned on me today that some of these have images of the websites, and some of them don't. And I, I don't, I never was bothered by it. I never cared about it until this morning when I had to go and search for a website that was way down at the bottom. And I probably spent five minutes reading each of these, you know, names over here. And it just took me a while to find it. Now, I know I could have came up here and typed it in, but I didn't. So now I started looking around and if you come into your site information little tab thing here and if you set the root URL to your website that you're you know connecting to and save it it actually goes into like this little loading thing right here where it pulls up the image of your homepage so it's 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 one of those things where now I can easily recognize what that is because you know when you spend a lot of time looking at a website you can I, I tell you what I can find the look of my homepage a lot faster than I can read for CSS boss you know it's a it's a visual thing so you know what what I'm gonna be doing now is I'm gonna go through here and I'm gonna set all of my domains up inside the root URL for my clients just you know it's um it doesn't really do anything other than maybe save you time as you start going through and working on you know more and more projects I, I think it's a great habit to start well fix your habit ha huh? okay so yeah basically like you can already see like now when you know Fronos photos is I haven't worked on that in like a month you know like the old servers right here you know, as it goes down, I'll be able to easily come down and, and find it and just like pinpoint it or, you know, scratch and paint. Matano's website, you know, I, I spent a lot of time looking for his this morning. So, you know, now I'll, I'll be able to come through and like I know that's Dogtown Diesel and that's Eating for Energy and, you know, there's JaredPoland.com and Things to Look at High and, you know, MUT Evolution. It's just, you know, Underground Wellness right here, you know, WWW. And it, it's so fast to do. You just, I, I, I can't believe I haven't done this yet. And it's already just looking so much better and more friendly to me. I can, you know, easily, I can see all my websites as they are. Oops. Okay, so I'm going to be coming out with a few more Coda tutorials. Make sure to check back for those. Thanks a lot for watching this. Let me know if you have any questions, WordPress, web development, CSS, HTML, whatever. Um, anything you need to know, hit me up. There's a contact button on my website. Just go ahead and shoot me emails. Make sure to like me on Facebook, subscribe to my YouTube channel, all that good stuff, and I'll see you later. Andrew Kayser with CSSBoss.com. Peace out.